Tanzania is not known for making movies, but Binti, a story about perseverance told through the lives of four women getting on streaming platform Netflix, might change that. They believed in the story, that it was a universal story that would be able to resonate um, with people from all across the globe. The film's producers, sisters Angela and Alinda Ruhinda, say local filmmakers have many good ideas, but realizing them has been challenging. Telling stories takes money, and there are not a lot of um, opportunities to get the funding for a good quality film. Yeah. Yeah. More than 100 crew members and actors worked on the film. Many of them see bigger doors opening after getting on Netflix. Now Godliva is in this platform, so her, she has been upgraded. You need to pay her accordingly. You need to value her. The movie has also caught the attention of many film lovers in the country. This is my first time watching a Swahili movie that is Binti and it's impressing, amazing. I think I it will be amazing. And, uh, personally, I cannot wait. The film's producers say because of Netflix's high standards, it took them a year to negotiate access to the platform's 214 million subscribers. Now that they're on it, the producers say more movies from Tanzania are in the pipeline. By getting a film on Netflix, Tanzania follows in the footsteps of countries like Nigeria, South Africa and Kenya, which have movies and series on the streaming platform. The country's filmmakers now hope to carve out a name for themselves in the world of filmmaking.